Real quickly before we begin, I want to thank this video's sponsor, CarMarshall.com. CarMarshall.com can save you lots of money on buying used or new vehicles, cars, trucks, school buses. If you want to save money, I'll have a link in the description down below. I know I'm going to... Police now threatening to arrest people who make fun of their Facebook posts about drug busts. Police are now threatening to arrest anyone who criticizes the small-time drug busts that they brag about on Facebook. By John Vibes, May 13, 2018. When stumbling across a police department's social media page, it's easy to see how out of touch law enforcement is with the rest of society. If police understood what people truly cared about, their social media pages would at least give lip service to violent crime, and they would use these platforms as propaganda tools to give the illusion that they are making people safe. Instead, police typically decide to put their typical day-to-day -day activities on display, which usually amount to nothing more than harassing peaceful people like you and me for small nonviolent drug offenses. This being the internet, these types of posts are usually a magnet for activists and free thinkers who troll the police and shame them for their authoritarianism. Unfortunately for people in the UK, free speech is becoming increasingly restricted online, and the police in West Yorkshire have recently threatened to arrest those who criticize their drug busts. After a large swarm of people began to call them clowns and jerks for arresting harmless drug users instead of fighting real crime, the West Yorkshire police made a post stating that they deleted comments and blocked users from commenting. They also threatened to make arrests for insulting the officers, citing the Malicious Communications Act of 1988. The post read, Unfortunately we have had to ban a number of people from using this page today. I would like to remind everyone that this is a police page and whatever your thoughts on one of my officers seizing drugs in the community, being insulting, abusive or offensive can and will result in a prosecution under the Malicious Communications Act 1988. We will not overlook the significant harm that illegal drugs cause to our communities. We know from experience that this can progress from using what are perceived to be recreational drugs to more addictive and harmful substances and the resulting criminality used to fund their continued use. Please use this page with respect or you will be banned and maybe even prosecuted. As expected, this post has only called more attention and brought more criticism to the page, drawing many activists from outside the country who cannot be prosecuted under the UK's anti-speech laws. The Malicious Communications Act 1988, MCA, is a British Act of Parliament that makes it illegal in England and Wales to send or deliver letters or other articles for the purpose of causing distress or anxiety. It also applies to electronic communications. Police the UK made similar threats last month citing the MCA, in regards to the public outcry about the medical kidnap of the sick child Alfie Evans. In the midst of the controversy, Merseyside Police Department threatened to arrest online posters who were insulting the doctors, judges, and police about how they handled the situation. Hey, Sheriff County, this is Sheriff County Cop Watch, and I just wanted you to know that uh, I am using this stuff under fair use. And uh, also, uh, remember to like and subscribe this channel. Uh, also, too, uh, keep in mind, I do not make any money on YouTube. Uh, this is uh, five hours work a day, uh, you know, fighting for freedom. And uh, I do, I, you can donate with PayPal and Patreon. Uh, I just want you to think about this. If everybody gives uh, to PayPal and Patreon, Patreon is every month. Actually, PayPal you can do every month. I have 12,000 subscribers. If everybody gives, I can uh, quit my regular job and go full-time investigations on Charlotte County and possibly even more and beyond. So just keep that in mind. If everybody helps out, I can go full-time doing this. Thanks.